Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol SHLL. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. If you're not sure what I mean by 30 minute, I do offer an explanation video at that link. Quite the eventful day today, and not even really day, because for the majority of the day, nothing was going on. Real volume was very low. Now, to be fair, I mean, it did have a nice little healthy consolidation there. But then, you know, the money was made this afternoon. Volume came pouring in. Price broke out of the consolidation, broke above that red line, which I'll talk about here in just a second. And then from there, yeah, the rest is history, a fantastic breakout, which brings about our first update. And this update is just based on a foundational rule in charting, which states when levels of resistance are broken and closed above, you want to see the MACD as support. So for those of you that have been watching my past videos, been talking right around that 41, uh, you know, 40-ish area as that level of resistance and you can see it got the breakout right there. Now, did I know or did anybody know that if the price broke above there, it would be that crazy of a breakout? No, no, nobody quite knew that. But yeah, it makes sense why that thing did get some good solid follow through after the breakout there. But point here being, that's going to be one of the newest areas of support. Now, from more so the overarching standpoint in terms of supports, that's where you're going to want to watch the purple line there, the 50 period, simple moving average. Keyword being moving because I get it. The price is way up here. This line's way down there. But as time goes on, that line is going to move itself higher and higher and get more more relevant, which is helpful because when it comes to just gauging the health of the overall move, that right there being defined as the move, just watch that purple line. As long as the price stays above that line, as the line itself moves higher and higher, then the bulls are in full health, the bulls are in full control. How you can best visualize that, that is what is being represented. As far as areas of resistance are concerned, I want to say this is at all-time highs right now. Yeah, as, as far as resistance levels, let me just double check. Pretty sure this is in, yeah, blue sky breakout territory. So you're just gonna have to use your gut instincts right now. Let the chart give you a little bit more data. But that's always a good problem to have with the, when a breakout is in blue sky territory. But overall, yeah, the week is young. It's only Tuesday, still three days left. So let's see how this one continues to play out. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too good, way too, good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.